Hello everyone, it's Gabby and I have a Trader Joe's haul for you today. It is Monday, January 31st, 2022 and my total is $131.40. I went into the store hungry. I had just gotten off work and I was hungry. So, um, But still, I think I made some pretty good choices. There are a few items here that are new to me at least and um, let me just show you what I picked up. Um, Charles Shaw Wine. This is 2018 California Pinot Grigio made with organic grapes. I've had the Charles Shaw organic wine before and it's delicious. Really good, really smooth. Next to it, Two Buck Chuck Cabernet Sauvignon and Merlot. Real good. This caught my eye. I, I had been looking for this. And um, this is Trader Joe's Organic Shelled Hemp Seeds, just the hemp hearts. I used to buy online hemp seed oil, and I, I would even cook with it, but it became a little bit pricey. And this will actually um, still give me the nutritional um, benefits. So as you can see, 10 grams of protein, 2.5 omega-3, 8.5 of omega-6 fatty acids. So I don't know. I would put this in a smoothie or include it into my um, overnight oats because I already put flaxseed and quinoa and stuff like that in my overnight oats. And it's, it's good. It's really good. This, oh, this bread is new to me today. I already tasted it. It smells wonderful. It looks incredible. Look at the seeds. It is super bread, organic super bread, and it has pumpkin seeds, flax seeds, sunflower seeds, carrots, dried apples, and sesame seeds. It is so good. I just had it. My gosh, delicious. This is another delicious item. My son and I really love to make brownies. Trader Joe's brownie truffle baking mix um, made with Dutch cocoa and chocolate chips. So we are going to make this as soon as possible. My favorite cereal from Trader Joe's is a super nutty oat cluster cereal, a blend of oat clusters, flakes, pecans, almonds, and Brazil nuts. Even with a touch of Greek yogurt, it's real good. Uh, this is the Trader Joe's premium salmon burgers because I had been craving that. And then next to it, I found the Mahi Mahi burgers. And these are going to be delicious. My favorite Trader Joe's blueberry waffles. There's an eight count in here. Another breakfast item that I'm going to try is the Trader Joe's egg frittata with Swiss cheese and cauliflower. My favorite traditional latkes, potato pancakes. And since everything here ends up in a crock pot, I'm going to make crock pot pizza that my son requested. This is ready to bake um, dough with garlic and herbs. This is a low fat, it says low fat product. You can even make breadsticks or, you know, calzone. And then I always use this as the topping, the Citerio Genoa Salami and Provolone Cheese. It just tastes really good. Taquitos. I have chicken taquitos and my son's favorite black bean and cheese taquitos. Sorry. Um, they changed the packaging. And I did notice in the store there are a lot of items that have um, different packaging. And I thought this was pretty eye-catching. So that was cool. Um... This was highly recommended by the checkout girl. Trader Joe's chicken and chimichurri empanadas. Dark chicken meat, vegetables, chimichurri, sauce, and a traditional flaky pastry. And I'm all about that. So it has two empanadas. And right next to it was the cheese empanadas with cassava crust. Filled with cheeses, caramelized onions, and spinach. This is a gluten-free product, and there's a, uh, two of them in there. We needed meatballs, so I got my son two bags of Italian-style fully cooked meatballs. They're really good. And I got me the turkey meatballs. Here is a package of cilantro. I always have to keep that on hand. And this is the organic shredded green and red cabbage with carrots. 
I'm going to have this with, I saute it with onions and um, olive oil, a little bit of seasoning, and I have that with my pierogies with a little bit of sour cream. My son loves tomato soup, so I got the tomato and roasted red pepper soup. This pasta sauce was a hit the last time I bought it. The creamy tomato basil pasta sauce. That's why I got two. And um, I think the last time, what did I make? I made tortellini shrimp pasta with this sauce. My son loved it. It was so good. I picked up uh, two limes, no biggie. This is what I'm talking about when it comes to their packaging. I just bought these apples because of the packaging. Look at how fun and festive this looks. I just grabbed it. I didn't care what was in it. But these are apples. The brand is called Kanzi. A crisp, juicy, sweetly tart apple with intense flavor. But the packaging was festive and fun. I also picked up, this is a sun-kissed brand, um, Blood Oranges. I need some citrus. I've picked this sauce up before and I can't remember if I liked it or not, but I'm going to try it again. So it is called Magnifi Sauce, a tangy sauce of secret proportions. I guess for burgers, maybe I'll try it on the salmon burger or the Mahi Mahi burger. Who knows? Underneath is the Trader Joe's Salsa Authentica. And I picked up the organic corn chip dippers for that. This is new. This is black garlic. So, ground fermented black garlic, subtly sweet, caramelized like flavor, full of unami. So, dried ground black garlic, rice hull, and the blah 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 but I already tried it. It's delicious. It's really good. And to mix in with our pasta sauce and stuff that we make, the Italian style sofrito. I bought one for my brother. His, his uh, Christmas gift was themed. He's hooked on it too. Okay. And this is my son's favorite chipotle black bean dip. He could have that with the chips or with his crackers or he'll get creative. Maybe he could put it on his taquitos. Didn't think of that. Some organic hot cocoa mix for the cold weather. This ice cream is crazy good. Coffee bean um, ice cream. So, but that's for me. And I think that is it. Short and sweet, but delicious. Okay, I'm going to have a delicious afternoon. I don't know what I'm going to eat first. Probably... One of these empanadas. Later on in the evening, I'll make myself a mahi-mahi burger or a salmon burger. Who knows? So that's pretty much it. I wanted to share this with you guys. I couldn't wait to get home and show you guys what I purchased. I'm happy with everything that I found today. I didn't go too overboard, you know, with the budget. Though I did go in hungry, but, you know, what else was I going to do? It was on the way home. That's it. I'm going to stop being chatty. I'm going to put all this stuff away. I'm going to finish my day. Talk to you guys later. Don't forget to be safe, be wise, be well, and most of all, be happy. And I'll see you at the next Trader Joe's haul.